Hey everyone, Miss Wears here. Today we're gonna learn how to count and clap in our band class, specifically whole notes and half notes for today. First things first, we need to be in ready position. So go ahead and go there. You're sitting up nice and tall. Your feet are flat on the ground. You have a nice 90 degree angle in your legs. Your chin should be parallel with the ground and our hands are gonna be on our lap. Now clapping position is very similar to ready position. The only difference is you have your hands out in front of you like this. My left hand is going to be slightly higher. My right hand has that little cupping shape. That way when I clap, I get a nice big full sound. Make sure your hands are directly in front of you. You don't want them to be too low because then you'll be slouching over. Okay, so sitting up tall, hands out in front of you, just like this. This is our clapping position. Everybody go there. And we're going to practice clapping right on beat one together. Now, when I turn on the metronome, I want you to make sure that you're tapping your foot right with that beat. Here we go, let's try clapping together. Hands are up, and one, two, ready, go. Clap, try it again, and one, two, ready, go. Clap, make sure you're tapping your foot, and one, two, ready, go. Clap, awesome. Now, I want you to imagine that we are in four, four time, which means there are four beats in the measure and the quarter note receives the beat. If I were to count this measure, it would just be one, two, three, four. So I want us to practice kind of counting those beats in this four, four time and just on a loop so we get used to counting to four. Here we go, try it with me. One, two, ready, count. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Stop. Now, imagine your whole note. We know that the whole note takes up four beats. If we had a whole note and a four, four measure, it would take up all four of those beats. If I counted it, it would sound something like this. One. Do you see how I held it out all the way through beat four? And I stopped it on that next beat. Here it is again with the metronome. One. So try that with me, just counting. Go ahead and put your hands on your lap. One, two, ready, count. One. Yeah, and we hold out that beat one because that's where the note starts and that's what it's gonna sound like on your instrument. Whether you're a wind player using your air or if you're percussion, it's just gonna have that one strike right on beat one. Let's try counting it one more time. Here we go. And tap your foot. One, two, ready, count. One. Yeah, so in your head, you have to be thinking one, two, three, four, so you don't get lost. Now I would like to add the clap to that. When we clap our whole note, we're gonna clap right on beat one, and then we're gonna have some extra motion to keep the pulse for two, three, and four. I'll show you what I mean. It would look like this. One. So you see how on beat one, I started the note, I clapped, and then I pulsed on two, three, four. And then when I stopped the note, my hands came apart like this. So let's try it all together, counting and clapping our whole note. Hands are up, tap your foot, and one, two, ready, go. One. Try it again. One, two, ready, go. One. Yeah, so anytime that we have any kind of rest, our hands are gonna go out to the side. That means I'm not clapping, I'm not counting, and I'm not making a sound on my instrument, okay? So hands out to the side like this. So let's talk about our whole rest for just a second. That also takes up four beats. And so we're gonna pulse out to the side like this. One, two, three, four so that we keep track of those beats. Now for any of our rests, I want you to whisper those counts so that we keep track of what beat we're on. So if I were to do one whole rest, it would sound like this. I'd have my hands starting here, and I'd go one, two, three, four. So if I put both of those together, let's say I do one whole note first, followed by one whole rest, I would Clap on beat one, I do pulse on two, three, four, and then immediately after that, I'd pulse one, two, three, four out to the side. So let's go ahead and let's try that. One whole note followed by one whole rest. 
counting and clapping. Sit up tall, hands are ready. And one, two, ready, go. One. Awesome, try it one more time. And one, two, ready, go. One. Now I'd like to do that same exercise, but twice in a row. So we'll have a whole note, followed by whole rest, whole note, whole rest. Here we go, let's try it. Hands up, and one, two, ready, go. One, two, one, two, three, four. Awesome. Moving on to our half note. So our half note, as we know, takes up two beats. So if I were to count a measure in 4-4, four, four, I could fit two of those half notes in there because each half note takes up two beats. Two plus two equals the four beats that I have in that measure. So if I counted this full measure, it would sound something like this. One, three. So I started on one, I held it out for beat two, and then the next half note starts on beat three. And you hold it out all the way through four, and then again stopping on the next downbeat. Go ahead and try counting only those two half notes with me. Here we go, tap your foot. And one, two, counting, go. One, three. Again, one, two, ready, go. One, three. Cool, so when we add the clapping for our half notes, same idea, you're gonna clap on the start of the note, and this time we're only gonna have one extra pulse because here's one, Here's beat two, and then that's the end of the half note. And so the next one would be three, and then pulse on beat four, and then our hands would come out to the side. So let's count and clap this measure of half notes. Here we go. And one, two, ready, go. One, three. Again, one, two, ready, go. One, three. Cool, so if we move on to our half rest, it's gonna be the same idea as the whole rest, out to the side, but this time each one only gets two beats. But if we have two in a row, it's gonna look exactly the same, where we whisper one, two, three, four, for all of those rest. So let's do the same exercise that we did with the whole note, where we do a measure of half notes, followed by a measure of half rest, measure of half notes, measure of half rest, and then stop. Here we go, let's do it. Counting and clapping. Make sure you're tapping your foot right with the beat. And one, two, ready, go. One, three. One, two, three, four. One, three. One, two, three, four. One more time, guys. Here we go. One, two, ready, go. One, three. One, two, three, four. One, three. Good job, guys. So for our rest, the biggest thing that you need to remember is that they're all gonna be out to the side like this, whether it's a whole rest, a half rest, or even a quarter rest, and we're just keeping that pulse right here so that we feel that beat right with our foot. So that is how you count and clap whole notes and half notes in your class. Uh, keep up the good work. I'll see you next time.